pa the ride pager, I can ride on their backs. I'll be to dash. Riding wear. Alright, so there's more of this, apparently. Alright, so I guess I'm not done yet. Um... Did it say I can say I can uh, do B to summon a ride? So this is like the, the Uber or whatever, the Pokemon world. Can I go up here? I can't go up here. Let's go. Alright, so he's gonna show me the way as if I couldn't find it on my own. Um, Alright, can I go up this now? I can't go up that now. No random encounters, and... Oh hey, there's this trainer wasn't here last time, I think. Let's see. Last LA. No comment on the fact that I'm like riding a Pokemon or anything. Uh, this is another pick a pick. I've already seen one of these, so I might as well just kill its face. Um, that ride gear. Oh my god, that looks absurd, and I love it. Um, let's fight. Let's just take it down with a, a water shuriken or something. Okay, so this is actually level 36, so it's on par with my level. Um, let's see. Three. You're in the yellow. Okay, so that hit three times. Fury attack. Not the most exciting animation in the world. I like how we both use multi-hit moves in this, uh, in this turn. Um... I mean, I don't appreciate the fact that this is taking forever. Are you really hitting five times? Wow. Of course you hit five times. Um, anyway, I guess I got to see one of your attacks this time, which I did not get to do last time. And the Pikapek is dead. Alright. The Woodpecker Pokemon or whatever. I'm surprised they haven't had a Woodpecker Pokemon already. Ooh, look. So we're just turning into Ash Greninja. Yeah, I forgot to look at its, uh, at its normal stats again. I'll do that in the next battle I get into or something like that. Um, you're going to be sending in a Rockruff. Perfect. And I've already seen quite a bit of what this can do too, so I'm going to use a Water Shuriken. I'm just going to keep spamming this move apparently because that's... I don't know. Ooh god, the one hit almost took it down. Alright, so you're done. And I guess I've defeated the last Ellie. Yeah, how much money do I get from that? $800, very nice. I like how that's the first question I ask. Let's see. What else is there? Am I gonna run into any random encounters? I kinda wanna run, in, run around in the grass and see just... Okay, so I can run into random encounters when I'm on a... Uh, when I'm on a mount. Let's see, anything interesting? Pick a peck. It seems like Pick a peck and Donald Trump are the main Pokemon that are, um... That are available on this route. Uh, oh, and that rock rough thing. I've seen trainers use that. I don't know, I assume that... It's available in the tall grass too, because generally the Pokemon that you can fight trainers with are the ones that are available to fight in the tall grass. Um, can I go up here? No, I can't. Uh, what's going on? So there's more. Do I get to fight you again? No, I do not. Alright, so this is a uh, Skull Idiots. Oh no, this is Machamp. Oh, this is just a Sumo match. You're just screwing around. Alright, well, let's jump down here. Come on. I should be able to jump. Thank you. And um, I think that's it. Is that it? I'll run around the city just one more time to see if there's anything else that I can fight. Um, but I, I don't think so. I assume this is about it. This is... Oh, Young Goose. But that still kind of is the way that Donald Trump talks. With the, like, why in a, in a place that wouldn't make sense. In his pronunciation of words. Which I kind of do too, because again, I am bad at talking, but... Moving on. Let's see, is there anything else? Can I go up here? I can't jump up there. I still don't have... Yeah, I assume that this mount doesn't have Rock Smash or anything like that. I don't even have access to the Pokemon that I'm riding. I guess that's because I'm, like, renting it or something like that. Did I talk to you? There's more trainers, then. No. Alright, um... Then I'll try and find the... Oh, is that like up there? Like if I smash these rocks and go up here, I could um, I could fight that one trainer and fight the one at the beginning. I guess so. Um, 
I don't happen to have the HMM back, do I? Let's see. I wouldn't imagine so, no. Nothing in there. Oh look, a Z-Ring. And I saw a little new symbol flashing also. Which would, um... Oh cool, free spaces return, that's nice. I saw people speculating that that was just going to be a black and white 2 only thing. Because it was like a gimmick. But, I say it's not a gimmick, it's actually a, a, like a gameplay feature. Uh, which makes the gameplay like more streamlined, which should return, and it looks like it has. Can I... I can't, I don't have an item that I can move to free space or anything. Uh, I guess I might be able to move a, a key item there or something, although it's kind of weird. Yeah, let's go back to the city. Alright, uh, is there anything else? <clears throat> I've been playing the demo for almost an hour, uh, like 50 minutes now. And I'd imagine that that's about it, because demos typically aren't too long. Um, I'll find out. Let's see. Uh, perhaps, like, the slowpoke people over here are, are gone now. Although I doubt it. Right? No? No? Alright, well, you say that also. Oh, look, I can, um... Uh, I can hold the run button to, like, charge. Can I do this indefinitely? Can I do this until I hit something, or is it gonna run out after a while? Ooh, god. Sorry, sir. Alright, it looks like I can do this indefinitely. That's pretty fun. I imagine this would serve as like the bicycle, um, like raising your encounter rate in the tall grass and stuff, but... Anyway, uh, this has been the Pokemon Sun and Moon demo. I hope you all enjoy that, because once again, I sure have. Uh, my name is Dragonite, and I will see you all later. I really should stop this. Alright, so somebody informed me that there is, in fact, quite a lot of stuff that I missed in this trailer. Uh, in this, um, trailer, um, demo version of this game, so I'm going to be doing that. Firstly, let's see, so I don't see why we can't just, uh, pass through the, uh, this, like, map teleport, and we have to, uh, actually talk to a guy. Firstly, I did not know that we could actually do that. You there, what do you have to say? No, not right now. Um, I am going to go and smash through all of the rocks that I can find first before I go and take this on. Um, also, apparently there are, um, uh, there, there's like a whole other area in this game. And if you talk to the trainer, the, uh, the, no, I don't want to do this, go away. Alright, thank you. If you talk to the, uh, NPCs in town, they'll say different things after you're finished with the, uh, initial part of the demo. Didn't I fight you already? Alright, I'm pretty sure I fought that trainer already. Um, I'm probably going to be cutting out, uh, battles, like, from here on out, because I want to focus on exploring and not necessarily battling. Although, if something interesting happens, like, if somebody has an interesting new Pokémon, I'll definitely commentate over that bit. Uh, so we'll see. I'm guessing that the one trainer at the bottom of the route that said that she'll fight me if I defeat everybody is gonna have something interesting. But I'll get there when I get there. Yeah, that battle didn't really contain anything that was very interesting. Uh, let's see, I'm going to want to, uh, do one of these charge things through this rock. Yeah, so I didn't realize- oh, that's it. I didn't realize, um, that you could actually do that. I just tried running up to them and talking to them normally, and that didn't really work earlier, but never mind, I can do that now. You! No, not really, they just weren't very strong. Alright, so I guess if I- if it turns out to be any more exciting than the other ones, I will commentate over this one. Um, you are an ace trainer. Alright, so that's a very different Ace Trainer outfit. I'm still used to the, like, Gen 4 Ace Trainers for whatever reason, even though that's, what, three generations in the past now? Um, please have something besides a Yujo, sir. Oh, cool, this looks new. It's a Jangmo. Oh, I probably should have recognized that then. Um, in that case, I believe uh, Night Slash is the most uh, damaging move that I can use on this thing. Let's see, please? Oh. Well, to be honest, I still want to see what this thing can do, so I don't know why I'm saying please don't, like, KO it. Um, because I don't want it to be KO'd, at least not right away. Although, that headbutt... I do remember the headbutt from the, like, Hakamo thing. And, uh, um... That thing was irritating because it kept flinching me, although it didn't really do a, uh, a whole lot of damage. Anyway, so we're gonna be turning into Ash Greninja. And we're gonna be going into a giant, like, fishbowl whirlpool thing. And... Yeah. I also saw one theory, I... Again, I'm trying to avoid spoilers and stuff, but I did see one theory that, like, this trainer is Ash's son. Because, um, the letter that you get in the beginning literally says, Dear Son, except the, uh, pronunciation is different. And you have a Pikachu and a, uh, like an Ash Greninja as your Pokemon in this game. Which is kind of funny. I doubt there's any, uh, I doubt there's any truth to that. 
for a variety of reasons, but it's still funny. It's only a demo, it's not like this is a full game or anything. Um, do you have anything interesting to say? No? Oh cool, a star piece. So I'm guessing I can transfer these to the, uh, the full game when it comes out in a month. And I can, I can sell it for a lot of money if I have to. So we're going to be saving the adventure. And really, a lot of trainers like you in the Alola region. So is there going to be a boss trainer in, um, in pretty much every area? Yeah, I kind of think I need a heal because I didn't get paralyzed on the static. Um, Pokemon Center is down here, isn't it? Oh look, there's another NPC on this route now? Wait, were you here earlier or are you new? Because I think you're new. Anyway, let's see what else is there to explore? Oh, come on. I know, I know, I shouldn't complain about random encounters. Anyway, there is nothing down there. Is there anything over here? There's, uh, there's like Machamp blocking the path here, right? Are you going to let me through or not? Swo! And you? Pow! Alright, so that's not very interesting. Alright, so you're not, you're not very interesting. Let's see. I should be able to get through this, uh, this place, like, without going up through tall grass. If I can smash through these rocks, right? Alright. So you must have a very solid skull. Now, I'm gonna go this way and see what this guy's talking about. Yeah, sure, why not? Catching tons of Pokemon, let's do this. Alright, so I'm gonna get Pokeballs, I'm going to be dismounting Tauros. And 